everyone. Welcome to ElementalEnglish.com. Today's lesson is on the vowel sounds E eh versus A. Ah. An English pronunciation lesson. The E eh versus A ah sounds have proven to be difficult for many English language learners, especially Chinese and some other learners of English. But it's important to distinguish the E, eh, such as bet sound versus a ah, such as bat not because you need to sound like a native speaker but because there are plenty of words where these two sounds e eh, and a ah, are the only difference between two words pronunciations examples of e eh versus a ah. bet versus bat set versus sat Letter versus ladder. Said versus sad. So if you mix up the two sounds e eh and a, ah, you run the risk of being misunderstood. The key to saying the sounds correctly is how much you open your mouth. How to pronounce e. Eh. Your lips are slightly open. Your lips are mostly relaxed. Your tongue rests at the bottom of your mouth. Eh. To pronounce ah, open your mouth much more than with eh. Your lips are a little bit tighter. Your tongue stays at the bottom of your mouth. Ah. Got it? Let's practice. Listen and repeat. Remember, keep your mouth relaxed for the eh and open it big for the ah. Bet. Bat. Set. Sat. Letter. Ladder. Said. Sad. Better. Batter. Now let's practice with sentences. Listen and repeat. Notice how I stress my content words and de-stress my function words to create the rhythm and music of English. I bet I'll be good up at bat. I sat on the bench and set my watch. He climbed the ladder and fetched the letter for me. She said she was sad. He's the better batter on that team. Remember, if these sounds don't come naturally to you, the key is to get comfortable with uncomfortable mouth positions. Just practice opening your mouth nice and big for the ah vowel sound, and over time, it will become more natural for you. Don't forget to subscribe to the Elemental English Podcast on iTunes and please leave us a review. And if this lesson was helpful to you, feel free to share it with friends and family on Facebook and Twitter. Oh.